Over the past six weeks, the Florida baseball team competed in the Iron Gator Challenge, a tradition started in 2005, but back after an absence last season. The competition challenged the team in various physical feats. Strength and conditioning coordinator Paul Chandler was happy with his team's effort in this year's Iron Gator. One thing I've really seen uh, this year with uh, with the guys is uh, they've just been really just coming uh, to the weight room, to the to the track or to the field, whatever we've been doing, just with that you know grind uh, everyday type of attitude. Um, it's been a big, big difference from this year's team to compare to last year's team. Just a lot of dudes are really hungry um, to to prove themselves. As it was a competition, there were winners. The team uh, winners uh, this year were um, uh, Carson Whitson's team. Uh, team Whitson won. Uh, the pitcher overall winner was Brett Morales, and the position overall uh, winner was Harrison Bader. Last year, we didn't have the on gear challenge, so I didn't really know what to expect coming in. But uh, you know, just kind of we had a bunch of events, like 10 or 11 events. So I mean, I just went to the weight room every day, just grinded, worked off my teammates' energy and everything. So. It's nice to win, but you know, like what's more important is everyone's effort put towards it and everything. So it feels good. Uh, it was awesome. You know, I remember, uh, I remember doing it my freshman year with, uh, you know, the, the guys like Preston Tucker and Mike Zanino. You know, it was just it was a good way to really to break the ice with the older guys and to just get in the weight room and just grind with them. You know, so I was really excited to, you know, when I heard that practice our fall ball got pushed back a little bit so we could have an Iron Gator. Um, I was, I was really excited. Well, there was like a lot of grip related stuff and there was a lot of board push stuff. Um, I mean, to be completely honest, not to be, I guess, uh, not like cliche, but this is by far the most brutal thing we've had to do. This is, you know, it's just six minutes, just you know what you have to do, gotta make it by that point. So, I mean, in that sense, it's it's easy, but I mean, just again, like the, those last couple laps, I mean, you just stand at the finish line. So, this, this is difficult, yeah. You know, I'm proud of, of all the guys that made it. You know, it, was, it wasn't easy, and uh, you know, it's, 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 uh, it's a good way to, to end this uh, off season for sure. We'd love, we'd love to see it. You know, the offseason is really the most important time as a baseball player because, I mean, even though it's not necessarily baseball related, a lot of it has to do with your mentality on the field and everything. So to really have events you have, you know, on a day-to-day -day basis, you're working together with your teammates, I mean, it really doesn't get any better than that, especially in the offseason. So definitely like to see it again next year and for years to come. So Now the team will lace up the cleats and hit the field hey, for fall practice. All, yeah, for Gator Vision, One, two, three, I'm Gareth Gutierrez.